I'd buy that for a dollar. dollar, 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 dollar. What up, peeps? Mr. Bones back at you, and welcome back to another Dollar Tree Theater. What we're talking about is Monster Party from the producer of Sinister. Made in 2018, directed and written by Chris Von Hoffman, starring Sam Strake as Casper, Virginia Gardner as Iris, Brandon Michael Hall as Dodge, Robin Tunney as Roxanne Dawson, it was cool to see her back in something newer than The Craft, Aaron Moriarty as Alexis Dawson, Julian McMahon as Patrick Dawson, and Kian Lawley as Elliot Dawson. Three small-time thieves specializing in home burglary pose as caterers for a fancy dinner party at the Malibu mansion of the extravagantly wealthy Dawson family. But their plan for the perfect heist goes horribly wrong when they discover that the Dawsons and their guests are actually a support group of recovering serial killers. When one of the addicts can't resist the urge to attack, this, sim this simple cash grab becomes an all-out battle for survival where no one is safe. You know, the back here description tells the surprise plot twist. A support group of recovering serial killers. Definitely an interesting idea. So it comes on and you meet Casper, Iris, and Dodge. They're a group of friends, young adults, teenagers, or just of age or whatever, young adults, that like to participate in minor theft and shit like that. It comes on where they're running through some better off family house and uh, cracking their safe and taking their little bit of money out of there while Iris is uh, distracting them out front asking them to donate to a rainforest or something and then uh, they go to a park and swing on a merry-go-round and split the money and talk and then they split up and go home and Casper goes home and his father's not home and somehow he knows where he's at the local strip club and finds his way to the office where the owner of the strip club is beating on and torturing his father because he owes him a bunch of money through gambling debt. Casper says, give me some time, I can get you the money. But if you kill him, you won't get your money. And then he goes back and talks to his friends and tells them the shit he's in or the shit his father's in. He says, I know he's an asshole, but he's my father. And he knows that Iris has a job coming up at this wealthy mansion and gets them to agree with uh, letting them go with her and them try to rob the place. But once they start trying to mess with the alarm, they set something off, the uh, windows and doors all slam shut and the alarm's going off and it turns into like the purge inside that mansion. The shit hits the fan and it's a fight for their life and that's as much as I'll say this movie's a fucking blast if you see this at the tree I highly recommend you get it and check it out you'll have to get it and check it out to find out if Casper, Iris, and Dodge make it out and that is what I watched peace